Hi, um, my name's Emma. I've been homeless since the 1st of May last year. They repossessed my flat, um, never had a problem with anything that the stereotypes think you would. Drugs, drink, except for recently I've started to drink because I'm homeless. I can't get a job because I don't have an address. I can't get a address because I don't have a job. Um, I've been poorly. I was made homeless with a bone marrow infection. I know that most of the people who are homeless have mental health issues or are physically um, disabled in some way. They are ill. They are ill from the rats, from the food that they eat from the bins. The bins that they can no longer get to, I must add. Um, and we are stuck but to ask people for help, which is apparently illegal, apparently. Well, it's um, ironic. I've just captured some people just walking, just walking around here and it's like my spirit and us, we just met up and, uh, you know, it's meant to be. And you, I showed you some pictures of some of the people around mm, there. Yeah, yeah and you I know, told yeah. me. Yeah, one of them. Um, got, Ill. Yeah, yeah, one of them has um, a really bad. He has like broken ribs, and um, somebody kicked him in the face the other day. He was sat on the bridge where he sleeps, uh, or where he was. You know, when he wakes up, he goes to sit there. Um, and the guy James, I think his name is. Um, him and his girlfriend are homeless together, and he got kicked in the in the chest and in the face because he's homeless. Um, I myself have been beaten up by two groups of youths and three guys. Not at the same time, three individual attacks um, for the very reason of being homeless. So the judgment is, is harsh. None of us want to be homeless. Um, there are people that fake, though, I've got to be honest. Um, and it, it's, it's soul destroying because there are the people that give us, who are genuine, who don't want to be in the situation, the, the stereotype. Yeah, um, I, 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 yeah, I don't know what else to no, say. No, but it's good that you can say that because there are some of them who are fake and there's those who are genuine like yourself. You need the help. And um, there needs to be a way where people can know where the genuine ones are. But, but I must say, um, there are services for the homeless, um, but they're also designed for the vulnerable. I'm not saying the vulnerable shouldn't have the help. However, a lot of homeless refuse to go to these services because of that very reason. They get judged or, funnily enough, or there is no help left when they get there. You know, we don't have watches, we don't know what time it is, what day it is. So it's hard for us to get to these places, truly. Our life is chaotic. And when we get there, all the people who have just come out after EastEnders are now at these places. I guess that's really bitter, I'm sorry. No, I can see but, your feeling, I think. I love, I love people and I think everybody needs love and help and I don't understand how I'm in this situation. I'm going to send this to Jasper, <laughs> alright? Thank you, right. love you, bye. Hi, this is James, right, and um, today I was getting an interview from a lady about somebody, she was telling me about people who've been beaten up and broken ribs. I've just come across him and now I've just come to him, he had some money here and they've stolen it. Can you tell me what happened? For the second time today I've been asleep and my cup's been stolen um, that I know of, about £12 altogether, which probably isn't a lot to you, but to us it's uh, a shower, a place to stay, some food, some hot drink in the morning, yeah. a bit of safety. And you was also somebody who, like the lady said you had your ribs broken? That's right, I was sat on the padlock bridge. Uh, four or five days ago, um, begging, as much as it's illegal, it's what we have to do. And uh, someone had given me a pound and his friend wasn't happy about it. His friend come back and asked for the pound back. And I, I said no. And he, he repeatedly kicked me in the chest and in the face. Um, there was thousands of people around. And of course, no one seen it. Um, okay, but do you, other than that, do you feel safe here? Absolutely not, no. Yeah. Okay. All right, as I said, I'm going to pass this up to um, the person I know and see what we can do. But um, I hope yes. that helps. Thank you very much. All right? Thank you. All right, man. Bless me.